Hey guys, this is Outcast Comics. Today we're going to be uh, reviewing episode 4 of X-Men 97. Um, my thoughts on it. And then also if you agree or disagree with whatever I say about the episode, uh, please feel free to comment. Um, like, share, and subscribe if you're not a member. If not not a subscriber to the channel. Uh, X-Men 97 episode number 4 was about Jubilee and Sunspot and, in Mojo World. Now, there's some things that were all right about it and things that I didn't like about it. Um, the things that I did like is that they actually went to Mojo World and you get to see a part of the world there. Things I didn't like about the show um, was that it was too short, not long enough, twenty minute, less than 20 minutes. And I think that's not enough time to actually um, do an episode in Mojo World. Um it was okay. I was exp I was hoping and expecting to see maybe Longshot and Dazzler, but they did not appear. You did get to see an older version of Jubilee, played, voiced by the original uh, voice actor for Jubilee in the '90s, which was that that was a good thing. Um, but again, like I said, it's too short, and they needed to make it longer. You know, I think they need to make episodes as long as Invincible. Where you have more time, more room to uh, play with the storylines and more animation. Doesn't matter if it takes you longer to bring out the episodes. Hey, I just think it would be better for them like that. Again, if you think differently from what I'm saying, please leave a comment. The second part of the show. Okay, so at the end of the episode, in less than 10 minutes, you get to, we get to see Storm and Forge uh, in Forge's cabin. And then the villain that appears is the adversary. Um, so the next ep episode five should be about the adversary and storm. Let's see how long this arc is going to be. Or if, if that next episode gets split into two parts as well. But again, like I said, I really do believe that they need to make these episodes a little longer. And if you're going to do a story arc, don't divide it into two. Just go with the one. And give it more time, you know, so that we can see more characters and things of that nature. For those for those of us who actually read the books back in the day and, and know what the storyline's about, I know there are going to be some changes on things, which is fine. You know, nothing we've ever seen on screen has ever been an exact adaptation of what we read in comics. So, um, hope you guys enjoyed this review. On X Men 97, episode 4. Uh, if you're not a subscriber again, please like, share, subscribe, join the family. And this has been Outcast Comics. See you in the next episode. Bye.